Davis comes to us from Brazil. Please welcome Eduardo Correa. I've never seen Eduardo Correa, like certainly a favorite coming into this. He is the only Brazilian competitor that is in the top six. I am not the least bit surprised to see Eduardo Correa contending. I don't think he's going to beat Flex Lewis, but I think he's contending for that number two spot. And the reason I say I'm not surprised, Dave, is because these competitors weighed in on Wednesday night. Of course, they have to be 212 pounds to compete in this division. The weigh-ins were done on Wednesday night, and pictures emerged of Eduardo Correa looking absolutely shredded, feathered, head to toe just looked phenomenal and that kind of started the buzz that Eduardo Correa was going to be contending this year this is the best he's looked he was fifth at this event last year F has finished third three times at the Olympia didn't fare as well earlier in the year at the Arnold when he took fifth but boy he has dialed it in and he's one of the hardest competitors that we've seen open Mr. Olympia or 212 this year uh, phenomenal, phenomenal condition on Eduardo Correa. There's a possible top three finish for him? I'd be shocked if it wasn't. Uh, to be honest, I think it'll be between him and Jose Raymond for that runner-up spot. And, of course, we haven't seen Flex Lewis yet, so we have to see what kind of condition he's in, although Flex is consistently in great shape. I believe he will win, but I think Eduardo is, is, is right there uh, battling for second with Jose. Give it up for Eduardo Correa, two-time and reigning 212 Olympia champion. Ladies and gentlemen, Flex Lewis. This is our first time seeing Flex Lewis on the main stage here at Mr. Olympia, but he has come into this competition as a massive favorite, and rightfully so. Interesting side note, though, he has been very open about this being his last competition at 212 wants to move up to the men's open and compete up there as opposed to staying at 212 a uh, decision that has been i'd say widely debated i think it's a, way, a good way of putting it flex lewis coming out tonight and in your first impression larry you're seeing what from him First impression is that his, his conditioning is good. I'd like to see him a little more from the back, you know, from the waist down, but his, his legs are always a strong point. And what, what really jumps out at me is just how big he is on this frame. You know, when you look at him do the arm shots, when you look at his legs, when you look at the width across his shoulders, uh, the fact that he squeezes that into a 206, 212 pound body, uh, very impressive. And I think that's one of his big advantages in this division and uh, it will be debated whether the move is a good thing or a bad thing the great thing is if he d changes his mind and decides that at some point that he wants to come back to the 212 there's nothing stopping him from doing that and i think flex just wants to challenge himself and see how he can do against the big boys um, to be honest i i think he was a little tighter last year i don't i don't see the same quite the same level of conditioning as we saw last year but what he makes up for his advantage is that because he has so much fullness through all the muscle bellies and so much size through all the muscle bellies, even if he's a tiny bit uh, less shredded than he was last year, again, it's not about whether he's as good as last year. It's about whether he's the best tonight, and I believe he is. Please take the first place award, the check for $40,000. The Olympia gold medal and the title of 212 Olympia champion to our winner tonight. And three time 212 champion, Flex Lewis.
So Flex Lewis picks up another trophy at 212. He is now a three-time Olympian champion. Gets his check for $40,000. Just a tremendous job by Flex Lewis dominating this division here at the Olympia. And Eduardo Correa in taking second nails his highest Olympia finish. He had taken third three times in 09, 10, and 12. Last year, it dropped to fifth, works his way back into the runner-up position tonight.